Well, read the label on just about anything you eat and you'll likely find that that product contains soy. It's the time of year when Louisiana farmers are planting their soybean crop. In fact, LSU Ag Center soybean specialist Dr. Ronnie Levy expects Louisiana farmers to plant more than 1.2 million acres of soybeans. As this week in Louisiana Agriculture's Avery Davidson shows us, if the weather is right, farmers could see another record soybean harvest. Every eight rows, this is what LSU Ag Center soybean specialist Dr. Ronnie Levy must do. Vacuum out soybean seeds, pour in another variety, and get to planting. This is a variety field test Levy is conducting at the Dean Lee Research Station near Alexandria. But right now, many farmers are doing something similar, planting their soybean crop. This year is going very slow. Uh, the rain conditions throughout the season, we started off with rain and cold weather, and we're still having rain and cold weather. Levy says there is a good side to the recent rains. They've helped put moisture back into the soil following several years of drought conditions in parts of Louisiana. As for the cold, well, that could have caused disaster. Dr. Levy says he planted these soybeans right here on March 15th, well ahead of when he would expect anyone else to plant and well ahead of the frost and freeze. But the reason why they're doing okay is because they had a layer of soil above the plant as it was coming up. And that soil sort of did the same job as my cap. No, not hide bad hair on a windy day. I'm talking about keeping the plants warm. That little half inch of soil kept them warm enough so they were not damaged by the frost. And because they were planted early, Levy says they could have higher yields. Most of the crops, the earlier we can get them planted, then we have the potential for higher yields. But weather has to play a part as well. This is a typical soybean field you would expect to see almost anywhere in the state. This one happens to be in West Baton Rouge Parish, and you'll notice that it's not irrigated. That means the plants must get enough rain to grow. If that happens, Levy says Louisiana farmers could beat last year's record yields. If Mother Nature will give us a little help, we have good varieties. Producers have become very efficient at growing soybeans. So we're hoping for a good year again this year. Which would make for another good year for Louisiana's economy. In Rapides Parish, I'm Avery Davidson for This Week in Louisiana Agriculture. You can learn more about soybeans by going to our website, twilighttv.org. There you will find a link to the United Soybean Board's Interactive Soy Products Guide. The online guide will show you a list of products which contain soy, ranging from everything from home repair materials to car care.